soon as we fix the controller issues, went wild. Sometimes divine intervention just comes comes in your favor. Your opponent has these, the <laughs> oh, yeah. setup's got to get reset, whatever it may be. Sometimes you just need you need you need the greater spirit to come down and be like, "I got you, bro," but you got to pick it up from here. For yep, sure, just a little helping hand. Sometimes and it's really just, just on you as a player to take that and run with it, and that that shows this late into a bracket. You know, it's getting late, it's tough to keep going, and he took it in stride this time. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, I mean, but this next match going to be a little bit different, a little bit of a change of pace. Yeah, I mean, maybe not too much of a change of pace. I mean, Fade. Fade was having a clinic against UX. I mean, just completely dominating the all-stage game. I, I honestly expect a very similar performance because Nigel with the multiple jumps, great and all for recovering, but that, that Jenny back air, that's no joke. That, Like I oh, said, that no. has nationwide coverage. Oh, nationwide yeah. is on your side with that back air. <laughs> Absolutely. Fade's definitely the most willing Jenny I've seen in a long time to just scrap oh, with your opponent. Oh my goodness, he's dead! Oh. Steal the kill! Oh my Speaking god. Speaking of that back air in this matchup, perfect example. Oh. Fade has wow. been on the grind too, entering a lot of brackets, putting in a lot of work for their character. Huddle as well, we never really see Nigel, especially this far in a bracket. Mm -hmm. He's shown typically that he's pug? typically, yeah. Most of the time, it's pug. Tuttle's shown that he's put in the work with this character. He's labbed out the combos. He's labbed out the extensions, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. which is definitely Nigel's strong suit. Beyond his disadvantage, where he falls short, he makes up for in being very oppressive. Oh yeah. Oh my God! Is that a is stock? That... Oh, almost. almost. That's that's something that's gonna be very important here. This, these combos aren't gonna be that bad on Nigel because he's pretty fast at falling and he's the lightest character in the game. So he's gonna die extremely early early to these combos. Mm hmm Yeah, I, I could see this matchup being a big struggle point for Nigel because unlike uh, when Tuttle was playing against um, D Gen, um, as you can see Jenny is not so easy to gimp. Uh, she, if, if, if you don't outright kill her, she very well will make it back pretty consistently. Oh, yeah. I mean, even right here, completely messes up his recovery, still makes it almost <laughs> to the center of the stage. Yeah, that's a really interesting thing too, because you can hit Jenny a bunch of times. They do, uh, as far as I'm aware, they do have a fuel system attached with the upbeat, but it doesn't seem to deplete like as, uh, as hard as you'd expect. Yeah, right. I, I, I think uh, the biggest thing is that she, when whenever you hit her, she has the she has the umbrella to just kind of glide back over to the stage. So even if the fuel is getting depleted and such, and also you're building up slime by getting hit and, and everything, like slime canceling, air dodging, just the overall gliding back to the stage, you know, Jenny's not really ever out until she fully goes off the blast, and that's kind of my experience playing oh, against yeah. her. For sure, Heavy especially with as well. slime up B too. Slime up B replenishes the fuel, so even if you get knocked off one or two times, you can still use slime up B. Yep. Still get mm -hmm. back. This game has been extremely even so far. They've just been taking turns, killing each other. There's Boxing not a each other. advantage state, but there's a chance. Oh, the oh, reverse oh, edge guard. No. Ooh, should this still is be not fine. good. Oh. Oh, oh, oh my god. No. Oh my god, Jenny is not trash. dead. Dude. But that edge guard, my goodness, the there nair the into nerves. the back air. Fade had Both the meter players. for the first, but didn't use it. I mean, honestly, I, I think Fade got caught off guard. I, I, I didn't think, I, I yeah. think they didn't think that nair was going to come into back air and it was going to kill them in that position. I feel like I they felt either. pretty safe. Yeah, yeah this, long this match has been so many back airs just killing each other. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, this is definitely back air wars. Yep. I think this is our first major lead. Um, what would be really? I oh, oh no, no. Oh good. Still good gonna make golly. it back though. Yeah, I, I think what would be really ideal for Tuttle is if uh, somehow they can get burst to be spent here. Ooh, I and... like the idea, but unfortunately not gonna connect. Fade just bust out the whole cans, knocks him out. Alright, is Tuttle gonna force burst here? He's gonna have to. 
Yeah, there's definitely two steps to this game right here. You got to get burst down, and then you got to get the final hit after. Ooh. Fade playing the wind, though. They're using one, they're using one bar to aggressively attack. Oh, my goodness. Yep. And it's working really well. Definitely knowing what they can and can't use to try and force the lead while still keeping their uh, safety. Already going to get back to three bars, though. The pressure is just so... <gasps> yeah, good you burst. Know, no, 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 burst that definitely was going to do it. Yep. Oh, oh that, that might, might be it. it. Oh, not quite. Not quite just hidden. floaty enough to not get connect or not have that connect. Oh my goodness. Total Total situation. situation. Has... Might actually be a bit awkward for Spade oh, because... It's so close. No, Anything will kill, yeah, but Total has there burst there. now. Oh. Yeah. That Nigel back air out of shield. Nice so back air. Nice back air. <laughs> the story of the set. Yeah, I mean, this, so is, far. The this is the most nice back air set we're going to see for the oh, tournament. Yeah. That's for sure. I mean, I, I, I think I think the pressure got the fade to a little bit there. They did have the they did have the slime to uh, cancel that uh, F strong on shield to make it safe to pretty much avoid the back air. But mm -hmm. I think they were pretty confident on that hitting. Maybe we're we're trying to save that uh, that meter for like a kill confirm or anything like that. But Tuttle, good recognition, gets the punish for sure. And uh, pretty clean game overall. Nothing really too crazy. I mean, even when there were mistakes, neither player really SD'd because it seems like it's pretty hard for these characters to yeah. kill themselves. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. A couple jumps on one side, a recovery that goes fairly large distance, plus a parasol on the other. Oh, yeah. yeah I don't have the crazy uppy, but he does have the insane airspeed. Oh, and yeah. Pound, essentially a pound equivalent, which just lets him come back from anywhere horizontally. Very hard to just let him SD. He just doesn't mm -hmm. do that. Same with Jenny. Yep. Looks like they're going back. Oh, no. Mm, looks like a techno drum selection. That's at yeah, least I what I saw. It back. Okay. I didn't really back. get it to see what Tuttle, Tuttle actually striked, but I'm sure it was fantastic decision making. <laughs> was Immaculate. Yeah, no. This is a run back. Uh, I like the idea. It was a fairly even game. Fade definitely could have uh, brought it back on that last stock with the three bars, but. New game. I think one thing Tuttle has, Tuttle. The, has the advantage in is. <gasps> oh no. Oh, Most players oh, do the hitbox. Most players that underestimate helpful. Nigel mm -hmm. and what he can do. So they might feel a little bit more comfortable, you know, not being so on top of their defense or their punish. Because it's like, they can write it off. It's like, oh, it's Nigel. But then Tuttle just comes in with the back air. And then wow. Nigel is your stock. Oh, yeah, dash up there. Yeah, definitely, definitely gave me some flashbacks of some Grandma Gertie combos. That's that's <laughs> taken straight out of her playbook. Up air in the slime dash up air. Such a such a unique combo string for this kind of platform fighter. I think uh, slime canceling definitely brings out the best in this game. And Gosh. my goodness, Tuttle oh, with these confirms. Every this time Tuttle's putting made on stage, he gets percent or the kill. It's so this, impressive. This nair mm -hmm. into back air just seems to be such a consistent situation. Fade has got to be, be really aware and cognitive to avoid getting hit by that nair because apparently nair, a move that does not kill, does kill because it leads <laughs> in back air. It's going to be so hard to play around that too for a little bit. Because Fade's going to be forced to go high, and then that just leads to a whole other bag of mix-ups that uh, Tuttle can go into if he chooses. Yeah. It's definitely a, a favored situation for Tuttle. Fade mm -hmm. has to, in all honesty, avoid these situations. But the first thing they got to do is take the stock. Too much damage has been done. Too much stocks have been taken. The Jenny doesn't lack kill power, but sometimes it's hard to find a raw hit, especially when your character is so easy, so easy in the air to avoid these these back airs. The jab doesn't send all the way, though. Oh! Oh! Yeah. That I edge guard not nice. sent him back on stage, oh. though. It wasn't effective. Just mm -hmm. need a compliment. Oh. The, the, the complete checkmatedness of that situation. We got the we got the axe projectile underneath, and then the missile attacking the shield from the top. Shield drop covered and, you know, just shielding in place covered. Got him ridiculous. There it is. Oh, I was just playing so evasive, that stock. 
That first stock lasted so long for Tuttle, and now we're back in this edge guard situation. Jenny might have a very good recovery, but she has no hitbox. But she's back on stage. Oh okay. no! We're, we're back, back in the mix. We're back in the edge guard. Nair. Oh, the Nair. The tech though. She's alive. Not gonna have to burst guy. that. Okay. Good recognition on not bursting it either. Mm hmm. Jenny, do be on the heavier good side tech. of the cast. Yeah, this is oh, this is starting to look race. really, 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 really favor for Tuttle. I mean, mm -hmm. I, I think the only thing I could say for Fade is that I hope he doesn't really use too much meter on this stock. Cause yeah, this is yeah. this is definitely a lost one. He got to fight this fresh percent. Got to get this burst from from Tuttle. Um, I mean, honestly, Tuttle might even use this burst pretty early in a combo just to, you know, keep the pressure on. Not even just use it for, to straight up live a kill move. Yeah, at that mm -hmm. point, you're already ahead three stocks to one. You've got room to sacrifice some of that slime. Oh, three bars. Oh, oh, wait. oh. 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 I, I thought he was about way. to cook something devious, oh. but he is going yeah. to lose the stock for it. Yeah, Most too many jumps. So long sitting for a there he goes SD. <laughs> yeah, I mean, he he SD going out the way he, you know, the way he is standing on business, yeah. just going out there, kind of. Okay, here we go. Most players with super to avoid each other's burst here, if needed. Tuttle using a bar. Oh, finds the down strong at ledge, forces burst. Once again, the Nair into back air to take the game. Tuttle up 2 0. Oh, that confirm off stage basically gave him three stocks that game. That was so well played by Tuttle. Yeah, I mean, that was that was like an absolute definition of just snowballing. Once that first situation got established with the Nair back air, the whole game got hyper focused around that, and Fade had to take some situations that were a bit risky. Um, for accumulating more damage, but you know, trying to avoid getting hit by a kill setup, and Tuttle recognized the uh, the aversion that they had to recovering low, and really, really took advantage of that. Yeah, Nigel yeah, with his very high air movement is able to cover a lot of space when edge guarding, and still make it back, especially against the recovery like Jenny's, who doesn't have a hitbox. You have a lot of leniency. Mm-hmm. I'm One thing that's very nice to see in this event, this. seeing uh, Total use things like Slime Dash as well, just highlighting what you can do with Slime. Yeah, Slime Dash up there to, to confirm a kill off the top was very nice. Mm -hmm. All right, let's see we're taking this. Miracle City. <laughs> now, this All is a right. very different stage. You have three platforms here that cover the whole whole st Oh no, not the early kill! Okay. Didn't okay. have killing, but we're still in the edge guarding situation. Mm -hmm. Finally get back to stage safely. That was very scary already. We're back oh, out yeah. here. One thing Fade's been very good at in these on sta off stage situations has been getting these uh packs. I haven't quite gone stage spiked yet. Uh that is doesn't matter. Tuttle's still gonna find it on the ledge trap scenario. Tuttle's definitely warming up to edge guarding the Jenny recovery. The nares, the down smashes even. He's just been so good at covering it. Oh, but as I'm saying that, fade with the kill with the snare. That was a great, great tech chase. Mm hmm Gonna keep it very even with that too. Tuttle is gonna have the slight slime advantage, but other than that. Hmm. Good Nair grab conversion. Never really seen that before too much out of Nigel. <laughs> Tech chase. Oh, oh he was trying to end it right there. Snap. Also worth noting, Jenny usually gets more slime than other characters. Her oh, really? Stats are, yeah, her, her stats are slightly higher. The multiplier is slightly higher. Yeah, yeah, I mean, that's pretty good for her as well because she has a lot of multi-hit attacks. Um, sometimes against certain ways, she'll also get a lot of chain grab conversions going on. Um, yeah, that that's a that's a fun fact I didn't know. Yeah, it, it mainly comes from moves like weak nair and the down air. This situation hmm. is so familiar for oh, this set. The EX. <laughs> Just the edge guarding, covering the ledge. Oh my god! Read the roll, but falls out. Oh, oh, oh the body kills. 
Oh, yeah. It doesn't have a sound for. Oh, it doesn't? No, oh, yeah, no. no. That move is strong all throughout. Yeah. I That's thought the body was a little weaker. I didn't realize it was just no. all the same strong. It's all the same. It's just a fucking rocket coming directly mm. at you. It's incredibly powerful. Jeez. They're yeah, taking this game for in stride. Yeah, just holding down this advantage. Oh, wow. Losing the stall, uh, but that's a good amount of extra credit. I, mm -hmm. I can tell Hoping that Fade... I can tell that Fade that is having a bit of difficulty navigating around um, Tuttle when um, he's attacking their shield. You know, it, it's a it's a situation where they're shielding on a platform, Tuttle goes for one aerial, oh, and then Tuttle's oh, no. doing a good heads up no, play. No, 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 no. Oh! Oh, the reversal. Still alive, though. Easily yeah, still alive. Blown up for Zen for not oh, quite doing that. Oh, that was going to the The random snap. Just... I think that was trying to be a shield drop. That's the only uh, thing that really exactly, makes sense for me there. Yeah. I don't think oh, oh. Oh. Forcing I don't think the burst, though, that's massive. Full story here. Oh. Wait, what? The reversal on This life stock again. is crazy. This stock has yeah. been insane. There's just been so much back and oh, forth. Oh, my goodness. Oh, strong. Do it a second time and get it to work now. Jeez. Yeah. After Tuttle all not of that anything. action on the ledges. Ooh. Oh no. I, I fear I fear another one of those F strongs is gonna is gonna secure it. Oh for sure. For sure that nearly killed. I think that was the best yeah. Huddles on the ropes. He's not gonna okay. take anything sitting down though. This is Nigel. Fade really looking for this back really here. Yeah. Oh no. He's been here before. This is from the oh, oh, oh my goodness. Kidding. Back air into the snare. They've wow. been so crucial. I mean, Taking that's it. Advantage. Yeah. 3 0 for Tuttle. Yeah. Uh, Tuttle's edge guarding that set. Dear Lord. Yeah, I mean, that was that was a great showing of just like the positions that, um, that Nigel can be strong in just by. Laying in the one back air and then just kind of babysitting the opponent off stage, mm -hmm. just waiting for the resource to be used, the stall, the double jump, the air dodge, anything like that. I mean, when we when we saw that situation of the back air, we all gasped. We were just like, "Oh my god, this literally could be it." It's 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 extremely dangerous in peril. This exact position yeah. that they're in. Jeez, yeah. Tuttle just kept finding ways to keep Fade in that situation too, even if he wasn't quite finding the kill every single time. Yeah. I'm just, it's... I'm so impressed by these edge guards. Every single situation. It was just so awesome watching someone finally take advantage of the fact that Jenny's, Jenny's recovery is good in terms of its distance, but it's slow and it has no hitbox. And finally yeah. someone killed for, killed her for it. That was very <laughs> fun to watch. Cash in the patterns was incredibly well done. Now we can bend you and pull it back up. Yeah, good stuff to fade though. Getting fourth out of 114. Awesome run. Yeah. yeah. Incredibly well done. Yeah, no, fade was. Especially that last game was looking very good as well. For sure. We're just finding. So. This was a very, <laughs> very <laughs> good. <laughs> 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 oh, 